Peruvian pequeños are a very popular snack slash appetizer and people love them for parties. So let's just make some. You are gonna have some wonton wraps, cheese, this is queso fresco, and ham. So get a, a piece, put some water, get a piece of cheese, some ham, and just roll it. Make sure you close the sides, otherwise your cheese is gonna, is gonna get out. <laughs> and do the same for all of them. When you put all the tequeños together, you are just gonna get a pan and put a good amount of oil and you're gonna deep fry them until they are golden. Why would you buy mayonnaise if you can make your own? Six easy ingredients. Eh? Oh. Have a lime. Watch out with the seeds. This one is fine. Go. One tablespoon of mustard. You can use the young or just the regular one. It's fine. Um, pepper. And then we're gonna add the salt later. So you're gonna blend this all together. And I'm gonna add some garlic. This will be like the seventh ingredient, but it's gonna taste great. Uh, this is very important. You have to add the oil very slowly, otherwise it's gonna split. So here we go. Finally, you're gonna add the salt, just to taste. Um, let's see, that should be good. More. Now it's perfect, and look how creamy it is. It is perfect, and it tastes great, homemade. Get some of your mayo aside, and then keep some in the blender. We are gonna make olive mayo. <laughs> so these are Kalamata, these are my favorite. And mine. <laughs> <laughs> so yes, blend it again. I'm gonna surprise my guests with Peruvian tequeños and homemade mayo. Please have some. Oh, wow. This is regular and this is olive mayo. Oh, okay. Let me try it. Mm. <clears throat> Very good, Chad. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> it's delicious. How about I'm glad you like it. Enjoy. Well, for the cameraman. <laughs> you deserve it. You're doing great. Mm.